What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. Time check, it's already 8.54 p.m. here and almost 9 p.m. And I actually have a very special mission right now. I need to go somewhere at this time and I will share with you why I need to be there at 9 p.m. So it's 9 p.m. here and I'm going somewhere like what I said earlier. I will show you where I'll go. Okay. I'm a bit close to my destination. <laughs> and I'm pretty hungry too. So finally we arrived at the destination and we will try different flavors of KFC Korea fried chicken. Oh, can you see that? They have this new flavor, Kochugwata. Got my KFC fried chicken. Wow! A few moments later. So yeah, I'm done buying my mukbang for tonight, and this is actually one of the videos that I will do for Korea Alimi. It's the program that I joined for influencers, and this is just the first video, like what I said earlier. And our topic is actually Korean food. So I chose KFC because, first of all, I like chicken. And aside from that, for KFC here in Korea, they have different flavors that you cannot find in other countries. So I think it would be very interesting for you guys to watch. And also, maybe if you come here to Korea, you can try this KFC fried chicken with different flavors. So I will remove them from the boxes for you guys to see clearly. Look at that. This is the spicy one. Can you see that? Like the chili powder? Wow. That really looks spicy. Set it aside. So for the second one. Ooh, this is my favorite. This is the corn flavor. Corn cheese. I really like this one. And the last one, this is pretty similar with the, the first flavor, but yeah, it's obviously less spicy. It's the yang yang chicken. Wow, looks really good. So guys, this is the moment that I've been waiting for. <laughs> After taking pictures and taking the initial video, it's time to wear this gloves. Why do I need to wear it? Because this is how they eat chicken here in Korea. They wear this vinyl tsanga or the vinyl gloves. And after wearing this, I can feel free to dig into this beautiful chicken. So, while I'm trying, and while I taste these different flavors, I would also like to maybe give a life update and chit-chat with you, especially about my current situation. Because I know that some of you guys follow this channel because of my scholarship journey. And I would like to give you some update. Before that, let's try and taste the corn flavor first because this is really my favorite i really like this it's it tastes like popcorn actually it's a bit cheesy and sweet so it's really perfect for filipinos because we like the contrast of sweet and salty so let's try really good actually aside from the hot and spicy flavor this one is really really good 
although this is just limited edition so you guys should definitely try it out mm. can you hear that it's still very crunchy i have water here with a stainless steel straw environment friendly So good guys, I wish you could taste it with me. You know like the balance of the sweetness and the saltiness, it's just it's just perfect for me. Mm. 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 Very good. So anyway, just to give you some update about my life. I graduated last August. Um, for those of you who watch my video with Asia, my previous YouTube partner, um, we graduated last August. So, if you remember, I was a scholar from POSCO, and that is how I was able to study here in Korea because POSCO supported my 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 finances, my studies. And yeah, I graduated last August, so now I'm working. Yes. Sounds exciting, but not really. It's so tiring. You know, working is very overrated, but yeah, I'm so glad that I have work in the middle of the pandemic. So, not bad. Let's have a bite. Mmm. It's so weird. When I take a bite, the... The light becomes darker. I don't know why, but I'm sorry for the bad lighting. But it's time for us to try the second one, which is the yam yam. Yam yam is like the, I don't know how to say it in English, but it's the typical um, like sauce for fried chicken that they use here in South Korea. And I think even in other countries, they try to copy this. In the Philippines, they have bonton and they have the soy garlic chicken similar to this one, but this one is more on the spicy side. So let's try it. <gasps> Look at that! It's so big! And it's like flowing with sauce. Wow. Okay, cheers guys. Let's have a bite. I'm sure the, the light will be darker again once I take a bite. Let's try. See? It's so weird. Anyway. Mmm. Mmm. It's not that spicy actually. Mmm. I like it. Mmm. Mm, 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 mm. It's getting darker again. Mmm. So. It's better than what I expected. Wow. Hmm. Because last time I ordered this, it was really spicy. Hmm. Really good. Going back to the life update. So I live here in Seoul. And yeah, Corona, Corona, Corona. Nowadays, we're getting a lot of cases here in Seoul, or here in Korea specifically. And I heard yesterday they recorded like 1,800 cases. Which is the highest one since COVID started in January 2020. So bad, right? But... I don't know, how about you? How's your life during Corona? I'm sure it's not good, but at least we're alive and we get the chance to eat delicious chicken Korean style from KFC. KFC, I hope you sponsor this video. <laughs> yeah, this video is not sponsored. Um, this is just a part of my Korea Alimi project. So it's a uh, a project by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs here in Korea and they invited us foreigner uh, foreign influencers 
to make contents about Korean culture, food, etc. Really good. Mm. Mm. One more thing. I forgot to tell you. The reason why I went to KFC at 9 p.m. is that yes, the KFC here in Korea they have an event, one plus one event, starting from 9 p.m. every day. So if you go to KFC, order one chicken, you will get another free one. It's really cool, right? That's why I had to wait, even though I came from work and I was tired. I had to wait until 9 p.m. to get this promo. So if you live here in Korea and you didn't know about it, go to the nearest KFC now. <laughs> it's really good. Like one piece of chicken, it's um, 2,500 won. And if it's 9 p.m., then you get two pieces for only 2,500 won, right? It's really a good deal. Mm. But this yam yum, better than I expected, really good. Mm. <laughs> like that skin part, wow. It absorbed all the, the sauce from the chicken. It's really good, really good. Last but not the least, we will try the newest flavor of KFC Korea. You can see that a lot of chili powder. Mm. Looks scary. But the name is Kotsu Kwasa. And from the name itself, you know that it has a lot of chili. So let's try. Okay, I'll take the this part, the wing part, so you can see here. Mm. Size is fairly good. But yeah, it's like drizzled with this also like sweet and sour sauce and a lot of chili powder. I'll try to avoid the chili powder, I'm sorry, because I can eat spicy food but not too much. Let's try. Cheers. Mmm. <laughs> At first, it tastes like tteokbokki. If you know tteokbokki, it's the, the rice cake. No, <laughs> but now the, the chili powder is starting to give its kick, and it's a bit yeah spicy. Although interestingly, hmm. Kinda has this um, like smoky flavor from the dry chili powder, which I think mm, it's pretty pretty appealing to the taste. Mm. Not that bad, but yeah, I wouldn't recommend this to those who don't really like spicy food. Mm. It's good. It's good. I like it. Mm. 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 Actually, the last bite that I took um, it had more of the, the sauce, and the sauce is really good, to be fair. Although you need to like avoid the, the one with the chili powder. But the sauce itself, it's not that spicy. Yeah. Mmm, why is it getting dark when I take a bite? Mmm, good. Good, good. So hard. Overall, I really like the first one, the corn flavor. I think it's very, very 
safe flavor. Like a lot of people will surely like this because it's not spicy. It's not, you know, like it's not that salty as well, but it has this perfect sweetness into it. So I totally like it. So that's it guys for my first Korea Alami video. And I hope that you continue to support my channel. I know I don't upload a lot and I've been very busy at work, but I still hope that you will continue to watch my future Korea Alumi videos. Also, please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. So once again, thank you so much for watching. This is Sherwin or Winsome, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! I'll eat more. Mmm. Mmm, getting dark again. <laughs>